Hey everyone, welcome back to a new plugin showcase. Today we are showcasing Join Messages GUI, and this allows you to create custom join messages for your donator ranks and just normal players, and uh, you can have it all in the GUI, which makes it very efficient, you don't even have to go into config. But a few things I want to mention that right off the bat is that if you're using 1.8, you do need the plugin called Title API in order to use the titles. If you're using 1.9 and above, uh, then you won't even have to worry about it. And the second plugin that you need is placeholder API that hooks into the player username variables and everything so uh, let me go ahead and showcase why you need placeholder APIs if we go ahead and join my server as you see it says uh, VIP and then it just says the player display name so that is why you need placeholder API as well so if you uh, have placeholder API you can do P API or Pappy and then eCloud uh, download and then we're going to be downloading the player expansion so go ahead and just download that and then if we do uh, Pappy and then reload uh, then it will reload and we'll hook on to the the player placeholders and then we'll go ahead and disconnect and uh, directly connect again then it should work and as you see it does work fantastically so that is the the two things I want to mention before we get into a plugin so now let's go ahead and type the main command which is join leave and that brings up your GUI menu so you have your groups right here and by default there's two that have loaded and then we'll go ahead into our settings and these are the settings if you want to uh, to do it so there's a, a default join messages so those are disabled because uh, I want to use these custom ones with the plugin. Now we have the message of the day. So we can left click to edit the last line, shift left click, middle click, and right click. So I'm going to go ahead and remove every single line except for the very first one. So I'm going to go ahead and right click it and it removed that one and now we right click again and remove that. So now I want to go ahead Now I want to uh, edit the last line so that is the last line that is edited. So now I want to edit it and we're going to be editing the last line. So we're just going to say um, Welcome uh, to my server, all right? So we're gonna say welcome to my server. As you see, it is edited the last line. So you can either uh, add a new one, so we can uh, shift left click, and then we can use uh, the placeholder API um, for this as well. So I'm gonna say uh, aqua blue, and then I'm gonna put the, the player placeholder for the display name. So that's a player underscore display name, and both uh, ended off for percents. And then we're just gonna say um, welcome back, all right? So that is what we're going to have for our MOTD. So that works fantastically. Now we can go back, and now we can edit each specific group. So by default, um, these are the two ones that are loaded, and and uh, you can go ahead and create as many groups as you want. And this is the specific messages and titles for each group. So as you see, uh, the default one is basically the same, except um, it has the little group prefix uh, VIP on this one. So we can go ahead and make a new group. So I'm going to say um, owner for this one, because I want an owner group. So uh, we'll go ahead and click on owner group to edit it, and it brings it into a nice another editor. So this is the permissions uh, for this group. So so you can do join messages, gui.groups, dot, and then whatever group that you just made. So if you have a VIP or donators or uh, whatever rank they have, you can go ahead and make a new group. And this is specifically for the messages and the titles, all right? So keep that in mind. Now we can go ahead and change the group item to our inventory. So I want myself to have a diamond. So I'm just going ahead and give myself diamond. Now we can go back um, to the editor real quick and we can change this. And we just click the diamond and we'll replace the, the group item in the inventory right here, which is pretty cool. I like that. So I'm going to change these messages and I'm just going to uh, go ahead and we'll do uh, fancy little brackets. So it's going to be gray and then we'll do a bold plus sign and we'll end it off with brackets. And we'll do the same thing, uh, player's name, player's display name, and you can use uh, group prefixes as well uh, with the placeholder API if you want to. But right now I'm just going to have a player's name. And then I'm just going to say uh, has, has joined. And then we're going to say uh, all... And we're gonna say watch out, all right? <laughs> so that is what my message is gonna be. So Soul Striker has joined the message, and uh, then it also has the leave message as well. So we can go ahead and right click to do the leave message. I'm just gonna leave it the same, all right? And then now we can change the title. So we can left click uh, to edit the title. So we can edit the title. So I'm just gonna say welcome back, and then I'm gonna leave the bottom one the same because that's my my username. So. 
So the priority for default is 5, and then a VIP is 0. So you can change the priorities for each one. If you do change the priority for each one, make sure that whatever rank is the highest, it starts at 1. Uh, so I would increase uh, them by 1, and then your admin would be 2, and then that is how you make your priorities. So it starts from 1, and then just increase it by 1, and then whoever has the, the permission node for that one, and depending on whatever priority, so even though your owner, you have permission nodes for every single one as long as the priority is set to the lowest one or one in this case then you will get uh that join message so just keep that in mind when you're adding uh ranks and stuff if you guys need help with this make sure you join the developers discord i will leave that link down in the description so let's go ahead and test out these join messages this video is being sponsored by Sangata. Sangata is the one-stop shop designed to help make finding the perfect plugins for your Minecraft server easy and efficient. With the help of continuous user and developer feedback, Sangata is quick to implement your ideas and improve the platform. With fair and just business practices, Sangata Marketplace gives you the opportunity to download free and paid plugins to help your server stand out from the crowd. Join the Sangata community by checking out the links below. Now if we go ahead and join again, we should get the same thing. So as you see, it says, Welcome back, Soul Striker. And then it says, Soul Striker has joined. Make sure to watch out. So that is the join and leave uh, GUI. That just kind of spices up your join and leave messages a little bit. So that is the plugin. Link is down in the description. As always, make sure you go download it. And this was suggested by one of VO Mark uh, on my Discord. I might have just butchered his name, so I'm sorry about that. But uh, he suggested it on my Discord. If you guys want to check out my suggestions and my Discord, that is linked down in the description as well. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. Leave a like down below. I will see you guys next time. No.